Grace, and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is A Voice in the Night. Samuel is called by God. Let's read. Hannah was sad because she had no children. She prayed, and God gave her a son, Samuel. She was very grateful, so she gave Samuel to God to serve him. So Hannah was a woman that who had, had no sons, and like one day, some God has day. Sorry, God has gave us son. So like, she was so grateful and thankful to God. So, so Hannah gave God to serve him. Hannah left her little boy at the temple with Eli, the priest. Samuel helped all blind Eli. He even slept in the temple while Eli slept in the room nearby. So Samuel like served God and like how he helped Eli in the temple. And also Samuel was staying there. Samuel was also sleeping in the temple near by Ellie's room. One night, Samuel heard someone call his name. He got up and ran to Ellie. Here I am, he said. I didn't call you, Ellie grunted. Go back to bed. So at one day, like Samuel heard a voice, like and he didn't know where it was coming from. So like in the temple, there were only Ellie there. So he has gone to Ellie, but Ellie didn't call him. Question Hannah gave her son Samuel to Ellie to help him serve a God in the temple. True. Samuel creeped back to bed. He heard his name. Samuel ran back to Ellie. Here I am, he said. I didn't call you, Ellie signed sleepy. Go back to bed. So Samuel has gone back to bed and like again he heard his name Samuel. Question Who did Samuel live with as he served God in the temple? Number three, Ellie. After Samuel heard the voice a third time, Ellie said, It is the Lord. If he calls again, said Ellie, Say, Speak, Lord. Your servant is listening. So Samuel did. So like Samuel heard a voice again. <clears throat> so Ellie said, "It is the Lord." So if he calls him again, he should say, 
Yes, Lord, your servant is listening. Samuel, God said, Can you be my prophet and pass my words faithfully on the on to my people? I can, said Samuel, and he did until he was an old man. So Samuel told God, uh, God told Samuel to like <laughs> we're from the Bible then. God told Samuel that can you like pass my words faithfully? Question did God ask Samuel to be a, be a, <laughs> to be a prophet to pass over his message to the people? Yes. Yes, we all did the activity today. <laughs> Color the story. Oh, yes. Oh, I have already done some. I have on the curtain that color I I don't know. maybe the light can be yellow It's hard. Oh, it's so late. I don't know why. <laughs> wow, purple. Actually, it is not really that bad, I guess. I don't know why there is like color in that picture. Maybe some people will like it. Like, I didn't finish this until. <laughs> it's like two. It's like. It's taking a long time. Why I'm coloring the curtain all this color? Okay. Maybe yellow could be there. Maybe the fire could be yellow a little bit. Okay, I'll... <laughs> yes, today I read the Bible story to the end and next time. I will do another good story. Then let's see you next time. Bye!